Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing another thrift with me video. Why is that always so hard for me to say thrift with me? Thrift with me video, thrift with me. Anyway, I did one of these in October and you guys loved that video, but I didn't realize how much room the Halloween costumes took up at the thrift store. So I asked you guys to see if you guys wanted to see another one in November when all that stuff is cleared out. And most of you guys said yes. So here we are. I'm going to be hitting up three different thrift stores today and then another one tomorrow just because I'm going to be in a separate area. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited. I don't want to make this intro too long. So let's just get into it. So we're outside the very first thrift store. It's about like 11.05, so it just opened up like five minutes ago. I'm really excited to go in. I really want to look at like coats, home decor, and I also want to look at a bunch of like Christmas stuff because I want to do like a more vintage style Christmas decoration for my room. So I thought that would be a really fun video to do with you guys. So I'm going to look at that stuff as well. And um, yeah, I'm just really, really excited to get started. I love going thrifting. It's like treasure hunting, you know what I mean? So um, let's get going. Let me get my key. Let's go. love the lace and I do like the silk but I don't know if I like it together you know what I mean like I don't know if it's like too much contrast with how sheer the lace is and then this is like really not sheer if you know what I mean like I also saw this dress which I love like look at the sleeves but I feel like it's not going to fit me but it's so nice it's definitely too big but you guys can see the vision like I love this part here and the big sleeves it's so cute i wish it fit me okay so that was like okay there wasn't like a crazy this lighting is awful sorry this lighting is like awful right now it's like so sunny outside um anyway so that was like okay i did manage to find a couple of things but overall like there wasn't that much stuff i was looking around like there was a lot more stock than there has been but there wasn't that many things that i was interested in um but that's okay we're gonna go to two other thrift stores and i think i'm gonna go to another one tomorrow just because i'm gonna be in an area of another thrift store um but yeah so i'm excited i'm gonna start the car uh, I'm excited to go to the next thrift store. I usually have a lot more luck with like vintage things there. Okay, I'm here. It is so hot outside. Like I'm actually dying in this knit sweater right now and Christmas music is playing. It's just, it's very strange because it's so hot outside. Anyway, so I'm here um, and I'm gonna go in right now. I'm gonna have my mask and I have my coupon and I have my own bag. Look at that. It's a 5.6, but it looks really small. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, there is there is literally one mirror in this entire store, and there's people buying it right now, so I can't try on the skirt. Oh, that was out a lot heavier than I thought it was. Well, these would look so cool in like an office. I know most of these are probably like haunted, you know, like these little mime faces, but like for some reason I'm really drawn to them. I think it reminds me of a doll I had when I was young. What? I don't even know what happened to it. I think my mom like got rid of it because she thought it was creepy, but... $27 for an old H&M coat? Are you kidding? 
Okay, the lighting is awful on this side of the store, but it fits perfectly. I mean, not perfectly. The waist is a little bit big, but definitely something that I can wear with like a thick knit sweater and it'll fit really nicely. So not worried about that at all. I don't like how it looks with these dark tights though. I feel like it looks a little too like Sunday school, if you know what I mean. But I do think it is like super cute. I love the pleats at the back. Okay, like it's cute. And if it was like a cream color, I would get it. But it's kind of like this like neon aqua kind of color. So I'm not like a huge fan of that because I don't really have many things that I can pair it with. So I think I'm probably just going to leave this one behind. I actually really love this top. I didn't do up all the buttons because I'm lazy, but um, I just think it's really, really cute and it fits super nicely. Okay, this is really cute. I actually really like this, especially for like hanging out around the house or something. But is it like $20 cute? Ugh. Okay, this could have been cute, but it's just way too big. I do love these sleeves though However, I do look like a pirate and like not in a cute way I do like the other one better that has a similar ruffle to it, but it just fits a little bit better Okay, I think I've done like five laps in like every section of the store and I'm getting hungry. So I think I'm gonna go home, have some lunch, and then I'm gonna go hit the last gift store. So let's go. I love these details, that is so pretty. This one's too big for me, but look at how beautiful this is. Okay, but I actually own this, like, <laughs> and I did not pay $26 at the other thrift store for it. in the home decor section. I love looking at all these little like knickknacks and like little figurines and stuff. I rarely buy any but I just like looking at them because I think they're so pretty. Um, so I'm going to show you guys some of my favorites that I've seen. I was expecting to so let's get started with the haul <laughs> as you can see I have three different bags of three different thrift stores that I went to so I'm gonna be starting out with the one that I bought the least at um, so I kept them all within their own bags of whatever I bought at each store so this is the one from yesterday I actually only ended up buying one thing and it is this really really cute little mini skirt it looks like this it's wool um, and it's like this orange plaid and I just thought it was so cute and like so like 1960s I actually saw an orange turtleneck that I thought I could pair with it but it was just a little bit too big and since this one is really fitted at the waist I don't think it would have fit properly I actually kind of lucked out because I saw this at the store and I couldn't try it on because the change rooms are closed so I kind of like measured it up to myself and I was like oh my god I hope this fits me and I tried it on as soon as I got home and it fits like a glove you guys will see it in the try on section in a second but it actually fits so nicely so I'm really happy that I actually ended up getting this because I was a little unsure of the size. Um, and then this bag is the one that I got from the first thrift store that I went to. And I actually didn't end up buying too much there. So the first thing that I got was another little Russian nesting doll. You guys know I collect 
these so I was really happy to find another one it is so pretty all the other ones on the inside are different colors so I'll do a little detail shot so you guys can see what the inside of it looks like but it is so pretty I love collecting these so every time I see one I like have to grab it I also got this little piece of like shapewear it looks like this and it kind of reminds me a lot of like girdles from like the 1950s and I rarely wear any bodycon skirts or dresses just because I don't think they're very flattering for my body shape and I'm really insecure about my hip dips okay like I will come out like flat out and say it like I really don't like how they look so this is supposed to help with that I actually have not even tried it on yet so I don't even know if it's actually gonna help or if it's gonna fit properly um, but it was only $5.99 so I figured I would just kind of like try it out I've never seen one of these before they're actually really hard to find so I figured I would give it a try and then we'll see how that kind of goes some of you guys want me to just mention the prices so this one was $5.99 the skirt was $12.99 and the rushing nesting doll was $9.99 just so you have an idea and then the last thing that I got at this thrift store is a another type of like a vintage um, photo album that looks like this so then on the inside it has the little page and then it has the really sheer paper that goes in between and I thought this would be really nice to press flowers so I would press the flowers and then I'd have somewhere to put them so I can kind of like create like a book of flowers if that makes any sense I don't know I thought that would be a really fun activity for the spring so um, these types of photo albums are actually really hard to find so when I saw it I was like okay perfect this is gonna be my new book of flowers so really excited about this and this one was only $4.99 so that's not too bad um, considering it's never been used you can just tell by the way that the pages are opening that it's never been used before so now we're down to the very last thrift store and this might actually be the coolest thing I've ever bought at a thrift store ever so it looks like this and originally I thought that this was going to be like a vintage toaster so I grabbed it and I'm trying to figure out how you would plug this in or like put it over like a stove top or anything and I'm like how does this work and then I started playing around with it but it's not a vintage toaster it's actually to serve like sweets or finger food so then you opens up like that and then it opens up like that and then you bring it to your table like so you put like a doily and then you put all your sweets or like finger food on it and like this is just so cool. I was so happy that I found this and it was only $3.99 and they, I don't know, I, I don't even know how I saw it. It was just kind of like on the top shelf and like no one was even bothering to look at it and I was like, this is a gem. Like this is amazing. On to the last bag. Um, the first thing that I have, here's the receipt. The first thing that I got is a wool skirt, or I guess kilt, I should say, um, and it looks like this. It is just everything. I love this kind of like blue and green plaid pattern I think it's so regal and so fun and like so perfect for like the winter months um so it looks like this at the front and then it has all these really nice pleats at the back which I think is really really pretty I'll probably wear this with like some sheer tights or like really like you know those tights that have like the black line at the back that's probably what I'm gonna end up like pairing this with but I just think it's so cute and it's in perfect condition and there's only $12.49 so considering it's a nice long wool skirt I don't think that's like too bad uh so really excited about this and I know I'm gonna be getting tons of wear out of it so I ended up getting this little cami it's like a little silk cami that has lace at the front and I wear these a lot with like knit sweaters like underneath knit sweaters and I just think it looks so cute and like so much prettier than like a regular cotton cami and as well as if you buy it from the thrift store it's a lot cheaper than getting it in an actual store so I just think they look so cute and so feminine just like a really nice little lace detail even if nobody else can see it I just like having something like really cute underneath my sweaters I don't know I just I feel like my outfit is complete when I have something cute underneath um but yeah so I love this I think it's so cute and this this one was $5.99. Next we have um, this little blouse which is gonna be so wrinkly for being in this bag but it looks like this it's like a little white blouse that has these ruffles going along the front and it's so cute it's very like pirate Shakespearean but like feminine and cute and like not like theatrical this is what the top looks like it's really cute actually I love all these details on it I think it's really really pretty um I just like really need to steam it but um I think it looks really pretty you can just tuck it into like a little skirt or something and it just looks really feminine and pretty um it even has all these like really pretty little buttons going along the front which kind of reminds me of like the back of a wedding dress or something but I just think it's really really pretty so I ended up getting this really pretty light blue sweater and I actually have a few of these sweaters they used to sell them at Sears I have two white ones and they are the most comfortable sweaters ever and no matter how many times you wash it they're gonna be just as soft I'm not really sure what they're made out of but they're just amazing so whenever I see one at the thrift store in a different color I have to buy it so I found this one like this really nice little blue color and I know I'm gonna be wearing this all the time whenever I'm at home I think it's so cute um, and it just has kind of like a cable knit 
and little pearls at the front. Oh, not pearls, but like they're little light blue pearls. Okay, but how cute is this color? I'm actually obsessed. I think this is so pretty. I actually don't own many things in this color. I think the only thing that I actually own in this color is the sweater that I got in my previous thrift with me video. But I think it's such a pretty color that is perfect for like all year round. I feel like this is a very wintry, like winter wonderland kind of tone. Um, as well as you can kind of wear this going into like the spring just because it's more of like a pastel tone. So really, really cute and versatile. So really excited about this. And this is what I'm talking about, the little details there. Very, very pretty. And last but not least, I ended up being really bad and I ended up spending the $20 to get this plaid pinafore because I thought it was so cute. Um, it looks like this. This is going to be really great for the holidays just to kind of like hang around at home. Um, as well as it was dead stock because it's supposed to be a school uniform. It still has the original tag. I'm not really sure when it's from. It could be like a recent thing. I'm not really sure. But I just thought it was really cute to wear with like a white blouse or a turtleneck and like some tights and little patent shoes or something. You guys know I love anything like school prep or like school uniform form inspired so I was kind of drawn to it and I was just like okay whatever just buy it even if it was $20 which I feel like is kind of expensive if you compare it to like the wool skirt for example okay so this blouse is a little bit too big for this um, but you guys get the point I think it's a really really cute it's like a little short little mini shifts little school dress I think it's so pretty so mod so like 1960s so obviously this is like totally my vibe and yeah that is everything that I got at the thrift store let me know which piece was your favorite in the comments below as well as if you have any particular requests for Christmas videos you guys know I'm kind of starting to do my Christmas videos a little bit early I am gonna be doing vlogmas for everybody that's asking um, but yeah that's pretty much it for today's video I hope you guys liked it and I'll see you guys next time bye oh and if you're not subscribed make sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that you don't miss out on any new videos um, and yeah that's it okay bye